Hi, I'm Freya Cox from the most recent series of The Great British Bake Off. For the Platinum Jubilee, I'm going to show you how to make some Victoria sponge inspired biscuits. They're really simple to make, taste really good and are completely vegan. First, we're going to start by adding the softened vegan butter into a large mixing bowl, then beat in with a wooden spoon until it's light and creamy. Next, we're going to add in the icing sugar, mix this gently at first so it doesn't make a mess, and then beat together until they're both light and fluffy. Use a rubber spatula if you have one to scrape down the sides of the bowl. Next, we're going to add into the mixing bowl the plain flour, salt and the corn flour. Start by mixing this with a wooden spoon until the mixture starts to come together. You can add the vanilla extract in at any point. I forgot to put it in earlier so I've just added it in now. Once the mixture has started to clump together, tip all of it out onto a clean work surface and then bring together with your hands until it forms a ball of dough. Line a large baking tray with parchment paper and then get a second piece of parchment paper to help roll out the dough later. Use a rolling pin to roll out the dough until it's around half a centimetre thick, but don't worry, you don't need to be too precise about this. Once the biscuit dough is rolled out, use a round cutter to cut out the cookies. You can make as many as you like depending on how large the cookie cutter that you have is. I cut out 16 biscuits which made 8 sandwich biscuits. Line a second baking tray with the rest of the parchment paper, then move the biscuits over onto this baking tray. Gather up any excess biscuit dough, then re-roll it and cut out more biscuits until you've used up all of the dough. Place the two trays of biscuits into a preheated oven to 160 degrees fan. Place them in there for around 15 minutes until they're lightly golden on the edges. For the buttercream we're going to start by placing the softened butter into a large mixing bowl and beat in with a wooden spoon until light and creamy. Next add in the icing sugar and start by beating slowly and then once combined beat until light and fluffy. Add in the vanilla extract and mix until fully combined. Next, take a piping bag if you're using one and fold down the top. If you don't have a piping bag, don't worry, you can just spread the buttercream on in a thin layer. Place all of the buttercream into the piping bag. Use some scissors to cut the tip of the piping bag off. You don't want to cut too much off, you want a nice small hole at the end. And then use your hands to scrape the buttercream towards the bottom of the piping bag and twist the top to make sure any doesn't come out. Feel free to have a little dance halfway through. 
Once the cookies are baked, leave them to cool slightly on the tray for around 15 minutes. Then once cool enough to touch, remove and place on a cooling rack to cool completely. Divide the biscuits in half and cover half of the biscuits with a dusting of caster sugar to look like the top of a Victoria sponge. Pipe small blobs of buttercream around the edge of each biscuit. If you don't have a piping bag, like I said before, just spread a nice thin layer of buttercream. Place a teaspoon of jam into the center of each biscuit and then use the back of the spoon to spread out the jam so there's a thin even layer on each. Place the second biscuit on top of each so you have perfect Victoria sponge inspired sandwich biscuits.